Welcome back to our Tasmania series. Today we explore one of the most beautiful and serene locations in Tasmania, the Bay of Fires. The Bay of Fires is located along the northeastern coast of Tasmania, famous for its signature orange-hued rocks. If you haven't already, please hit the like and subscribe button to see more videos like this. So we're at Binalong Bay now. Yep. See some red rocks. The famous Bay of Fire starts yep. here. Turn around to the burning Bay of Fire. What? You know? No, I don't know. It's, it's, actually, it's called the Ring of Fire, the song. The I Ring guess. of Fire. <laughs> the Bay of Fire. Yep, you do you. If you know, okay. you know. So, what makes the red rocks? Uh, iron. Is it? Yeah. How do you know? Because you told me. <laughs> oh, you might not be. Is it like rust? Like iron? It's like the iron oxide? I guess. And we'll Maybe see what happens. Clever. It might be. I don't know. I'm just talking shit. So, we just looked up a Google map of all the spots on the Bay of Fire Strip. Mm -hmm. And we are at... Fancy Reef. Yep, we're going to the very end and then we'll make our way back. Uh huh. And then stopping in kind of on the way. Yep. Yeah. Pretty busy here. Might go for a swim here, see what happens. Yeah. We'll see. What happened, Simon? Yes, my hands. <laughs> well, you've got to do anything for a photo. Yep. Risk it for the shot. Yeah, thank you. Well, as you can see, Simon went for a swim. And you didn't? I didn't. Why is that? It's too cold. No, uh, it wasn't that cold. Too cold. It wasn't that cold. It's fresh. It turned out to be a very nice day. When we checked the weather yet last night, it was going to be cloudy. But sunny and beautiful. Sunny and hot. So we're at, we're walking to Lee's 65 Oysters. We'll grab some lunch. Bit of a lineup, must yeah. be good. When we drive past, there's a lineup waiting for oysters. Mm -hmm. So we just got some oysters. From Lee 65. Yep. There's nowhere to eat them though, so we're just going to sit in, in the boot of our car. Yep. They recommend to eat them like straight away, unless well, you refrigerate them or ice them. They are super, yeah. super fresh, straight out of the water. Like they literally, we had to wait there while they had to open them all up. Yep. So we've got them. one and a half dozen. Yep. Let's see how they go. I'm just going to drink some juice first. Taste of the ocean. I'm ready. I wish to do a cheers. Cheers. Mm. Very salty. Very salty, eh? Mm -hmm. That's good. Mm -hmm. oh. Very good. <laughs> Where are we now? I don't know. Suicide Beach. Yeah. That's where we are. How's this? 
How would you Doing describe what? it? Uh, it's very white. I don't want to swim here. Why? Oh, look at the wall. Blue bottles? Yep. So what are blue bottles? So they're kind of like little mini jellyfish and they have this little tentacle thing and if you get touched by it, you get stuck. What happens if you get stuck? Well, apparently you're supposed to pee on it. You need to pee on it yeah. to relieve the pain. Yeah. yeah. Well, if you get stung... You're up. Yeah, right. <laughs> Does it? Yeah. So that bit there is the ear and then that bit there is the eye. So that's the ear. Ear. Eye. This is the nose. And the mouth is under there. It looks kind of from far away. But it's a dog. See? Oh, it's a koala. It actually does look like a koala. It kind of looks like a koala with his tongue out. Can you see that? Yeah. So, we've reached the end of our Bay of Fire day. Yep. Trail, Bay of Fire Trail. Trail, yep. So we're at Dora Point? Yep, we're yep. at Dora Point. Yes. Which is really part of the Bay of Fire. But there is some red rocks over here. Yep. Alright, so we're gonna head back to Binalong Bay a bit later to have dinner. Have dinner, see if we can catch the sunset. Maybe a bit too it's cloudy. 50 50 at the moment. Yeah. We'll see. Alright, bye for bye. now.